Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is my 2016 Silverado on uh, 24s. It's got the 275 30 24 tires. Um, so basically, today's video is going to be about my tech. So I've had a couple questions asking, you know, what percent am I running and stuff like that. So oh, here we go. So I have the factory, you know, tent on there. The back windows on these trucks are privacy glass, so they're always going to appear a little darker. Um, I mean, everything looks pretty dark right now but basically um oh shit i've got limo on the rears just just over the factory tent <clears throat> i'm just gonna shut the door and show you all what it looks like from the inside so i mean you can see out during the day i mean no problem at all that's 30 on the windshield um, limo on the front so it reads out the two percent here zero on the rear so at night i mean it's definitely difficult to see uh, but during the day, I mean, there's no, like, visibility, you know, I guess, factors. So, <clears throat> so far, so good. Um, never any issues at night as well, driving with 30% up front. These stock headlights are super bright, so you're not going to have any issues with that. Um, we'll say this. I do have a windows and exemption. Um, I live in Texas, and basically, if, if you are curious about how to get one, you go to DPS website. Um, you print out the form and just have your doctor sign it. Just submit that in and you'll be golden. Um, just got to make sure that, you know, obviously it gets approved by the state. Um, so having your windshield tinted is illegal. Um, my 30%, you cannot, I literally cannot see the uh, steering wheel right now at all. Um, I can maybe see like three or four inches of the dash. So it's very dark. What you do though, so you can kind of get... I don't know if I so anyways there is a sticker right under my hand oh shit <laughs> so anyways just have your tenor cut out you know a little spot right there so you can uh put your stickers there that way your windshield doesn't look tenor. um i used to have 50 on my last truck loved it uh, you could even tell the windshield was tinted so i i mean if, you, if you're if you're a little hesitant or living in an area where there's a lot of cops do 50 um 30 is kind of pushing it but you know once again you can see just fine. Um, one other thing, if you're gonna do 30 or 50, haven't had a chance to do it, right above this uh, AS1 line, I would recommend doing a visor, or like, you know, like the brow all the way across. Make sure you don't go under this. Uh, if you do that, it's illegal. Stay right above it, so that way if you get pulled over, um, the cops can be like, hey, you know, what is kind of dark? Just point to this, be like, oh, you know, it's all legal up here. Um, they probably won't even recognize the windshield. I mean, I've been pulled over probably like, Honestly, probably like five, six times in the past six, seven months, unfortunately. Um, they'd never noticed my windshield. Like, literally, none of them have. Um, and, you know, not even in this truck yet, but on my last one, I had it tinted up there, and you could even tell. But, yep, there we go. Um, just a little video for y'all. 2% right there. Yeah, I'm gonna open up this door, show y'all what zero looks like. So, there's zero. There's two, just a little comparison.